the beginning of the beginning. Sunday <laughs> vlog. Man. It's actually, it's already what, like almost two o'clock? It's over a race. You ruined it. It's 150. I just, I just started vlogging right now. Cheese. Hey, that was a good cheese. And, uh, so this is kind of my one of my last chances. Do you know when the vendor hall closes? Uh, four, I believe, because like four is one of the closing ceremony. <clears throat> nice. So I want to go through the vendor hall and see what I can see and perhaps pick up what I can pick up. Um, but yeah, no, this uh, this convention it got <clears throat> uh, extra busy here today just because we had to clear out of the room and pack up and and then host uh, the panel the families and entertainment which was a lot of fun and good times oh, there you are <laughs> I was like where'd he go he got so quiet so I am like I said gonna peruse the vendor hall the energy is depleted oh Philly did you dance last night I, are, are you serious <laughs> I danced with you. <laughs> Are you serious? It's Come a, on. Buzz Lightyear. Oh, but Buzz Lightyear. It's almost Buzz Lightyear. It's yeah. I thought it was Buzz Lightyear. Well, I'm gonna head off this way. Hey, you know, Pretty New Ham. Um, so Abner. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I, You're so am beautiful. I, am I, am are I you so coming up with me? I guess I was coming down, but I didn't dude. So you were like the ambassador of the concert. It felt like. How how was it all weekend? Oh man, it was super lit, super fire. I just uh, you go it was so. Fire. I had a really great time. It was really cool to see like everybody out there. Yeah. To, like old cards, like Alex, come back. And it's like, it's so cool. I love it. <laughs> it's good. Always good to see old faces. Well, good work this weekend, man. You're oh. busting your chops. Hey, I was trying. I was yeah. trying my best. Dedication. Yes. Yeah. So where are you headed? I was going to go to the vendor hall, but I'm like, oh, apparently I'm late. And uh, now it's like, I'm going to go find some of my other cool cosplay people. Nice. Wait, I, one of which I have to go. Uh-huh. Viva. I'm tired. Hi. Did we talk about Dragon Ball Z? <laughs> they stopped. Why? Why'd you stop talking about Dragon Ball Z? No, I'm not stop talking about Dragon Ball Z. Same old things. Yeah, what about what you want to know? Chaucer is he powerful. <laughs> Why would he's they powerful stop? Powerful then he could wipe out the planet. You know what's funny is if you think about it, a Cyberman could solo all of humanity. Like a Cyberman. All of it? One, one Cyberman by itself could wipe solo out. all of humanity. Saitama could kill a Cyberman. You think yeah. Saitama and Goku were? What do you think? a great convention. No, no. Because like if you think Typically about it, Typically I Saitama, edit. Well, he has Con vlogs. Powers and stuff like that. On the flight. Like, but I might have to just sleep. Alright, I can. On I this can one. Jump. I can punch hard. I can run really fast. I have. What a great week. Mm -hmm. But it's like, okay, Goku has teleportation. He has basically everything Saitama has. But he can modify week. it with key. Bubbles. It's some powers. different power skills. Yeah, it's just like, oh, okay. Because, like, if you watch all the stuff, like, beer it, like, uh, Boros, like, Goku would bitch smack. Oh, that's no contest. Yeah, that's you, mean, you mean Goku of Dragon Ball Z very start versus very start of Dragon Ball Z? Like okay, because Boros, if you want to do equivalent, he's probably like around Vegeta level because he's like yeah Vegeta, at yeah when Vegeta is Saiyan Saga when he was like I'm gonna blow up this fucking planet, fuck you, and he was just like doing that shit. Then yeah, Goku could easily just smack it away and just. Be like, right, How about Boros right, versus um, Nappa? Wars versus Nappa. Nappa right? has uh, better auto parts. Yeah. <laughs> Nappa right, know yeah. how. Nappa know how. Alright. 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 So, <clears throat> to finish off, Ronnie Gun, here he comes to save the day. Jack's blade. Ah, that was majestic. Thank you. It's, uh, Ah, uh, so, this is just about a wrap here on BronyCon. Uh, maybe try to do a little bit of sleep. Ha ha ha. see what happened. Remember that episode? You said, like, Thank you for such a great con. Oh, thank you all. I got my donut ready to go home. Place in France. Nice. Six. Yeah. Jax, you've been to six of these? Yeah, six. I've only been to five. Oh, yeah, you your, were in the 2012. Yeah, your number one was the one that made me go, I want to go to BronyCon. Yeah. 
So. Yeah, because you were at that one, and you were like, we were messaging on Skype, like, I really wanted to be there. Good. Have a good night. We just did a thing. It's on the rainbows that way. Oh, I knew Bernie Tom was gonna be busy. Yeah, we knew. Mm. It was. It was I'm, video, I'm internet famous now. Hi. Hi. So. <laughs> yes. Cut that part. Gabe. We'll see ya. We'll see ya. We'll see ya. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What did you think? Oh, it was good. Uh, did you? I had, I had fun, but I'm. I'm tired. You catching uh, your train right now? Yeah. I'm yeah, we're right there. Oh, oh. I mean, we're on the. Thank, thank you. Thank you. The convention. Oh, that was one. Yes. That was one hug. It. Come yeah, in. dude. Oh. Filming the bricks. It's, it's an artistic shot. I like your hair. What hair? The lady that's trying to get money from us. Oh yeah. Yeah. She was there. There you go. <laughs> she, she probably was in the hug. Well, in the event, Paleo, yes. Come to 2017. How was it for you? It was good. It was very fun. Yeah. What about you, Harold? I had a really good time. Thank you. Jax, how was BronyCon? Woo! Good. Yeah. We should do this more often. Yeah. It was a great Race. idea. Race. Yes, we should do this more often. Yeah, we yes. should, should we? This was lovely. Oh, this was nice. We should, like, we need to congregate more often. We need to do it. This I agree. is so good. This is so fun. This is this was a blast. Oh my god. Yeah, what a blast. So Paleo, any what were your highlights? Um well whose line was pretty gay, great. Yeah. I was, I was gonna say pretty gay. But yeah, it's pretty gay too. <laughs> well I got kids. Finally. You've been waiting. Sarah's gonna be like, finally. <laughs> yeah. Good. Oh yeah, see exactly. So just like, uh, what's up? Oh, yes. I was gonna say highlights for me is the uh, the live react we did, which you might upload separately, but yeah, the live react will be fun. Yeah. I can't wait to share that. Who knows about the goals? Laura, how was BronyCon? It was pretty great. Yeah. What was your favorite thing? I do like this building. Hmm. Moose Line is always a pretty big highlight. One of the vendor hall is also pretty new. I know, it got us, both of us. Yeah, I did. I was also an enabler, so, you know, I apologize. Yeah, <laughs> and you went, you got, you did more panels, I think, than, than we did. In this I show. always do. All yeah. my panels. <laughs> Didn't show up. Didn't care. No. Nope. Yeah, the, uh, the erotic fan fiction. Did you go to that? Oh, yeah, it was a good time. Was it erotic? I was, like, about yeah, halfway through because I was tired. Oh. It, was, it was fun. So you, you didn't Everyone get to the climax like of the story. I'm going back. Oh, no, not quite. <laughs> no. It was a good build up, though. Oh. I was like, you know what? This is. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Damn. Damn, that's torture. <laughs> that's torture. Yeah. Hey, Bear. Hmm. Hey, Bear. Hi. Jack, buddy. Hey. Jax, what was the highlight of your con? The highlight of my con. I was hanging with you guys. Like, I knew this. Right. I knew. Exactly. Yeah. Well, it's always good to see you, Jax. It's always great to see you, too. It's like. It's like we got to do it. Yes, we have to do it. It's like a rare Pokemon sighting once a year. Yeah. I just realized I'm like, where's my bag? Don's be dopey enough to do that. All right, Saber. This is our sign off. Is it on the way? No, but I'm I'm signing it off here. All right. Kiss him on the mouth. Kiss him on the mouth. Your girlfriend's telling you to do it, bro. Yeah, that's interesting, isn't it? She's in a really kinky shirt. Do it. Well, she was at the erotic reading. I wasn't the erotic picture. I know if Sarah was here, she probably would have. And I'm like, let's go. That's right, you dirty. But uh, so, I mean, I guess now we have a little bit of time to breathe. Uh, another insane year in Baltimore. Good times? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we're talking Who's about like, sunset. It was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. Was going you did a great job yourself. Like, we we all we did great. Yeah. We, did great. we did great. I love you, Sabres. I love you too, people. I love how so people didn't get to see this, but Ian Corlett made a comment uh, after we hosted a panel he was on asking, Are you guys ever apart? apart? I think Claire actually probably answered first. She was like, no. Nope. So, You're a duo. That was, that was funny. Well, this is going to be a sign-off from those that are left here at BronyCon amongst our group. Love you. I love you, too. I will. You guys have a safe drive home. You, too. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 I'm still here. Well, 
My train's here. Give me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is he racing? It's like the ending of Kids Next Door. <laughs> well, my train is here, which means I must go to the land of the flying planes. To the land of fun and rhythm games? Yeah, that's fun. With a guy named James. Have a I'll safe flight. Keep it posted. Texas, they want to get you at your gate and they got on the flight. I will. If I need a ride home, I'll let you know. You know, by midnight, <laughs> you know. Yeah, yeah. Don't talk to strangers. Just let Matt know he's really good at four. Uh, yeah. All right. They're gone. We got rid of them. <laughs> Mr. Larson, how are you doing? Pretty good. Hanging in there? Yeah, I feel at this convention, I just didn't have enough wings. Did you take care of that? Sure did. Good man, good man. You're doing God's work. Doing Celestia's work. <laughs> Celestia's work. Ah, 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 ah. Just like that, ladies and gentlemen, BronyCon 2017 has come to a conclusion. Woo. So, as mentioned throughout some of this vlog, I uh, I got hit with con cred this time around, and uh, obviously did my absolute best to keep my hands clean and wash them at every venue I could I could get at and drink lots of water doing some emergency, all that stuff, but unfortunately it still got hit and I'm really feeling it right now. Uh, I have work in about eight hours and yay. So, yeah, but that's a wrap. Honestly, this weekend, once again, just proves why BronyCon is insane. It uh, is so much fun. Um, the, the panels that we were part of, we had a blast with. Um, we were part of hosting three extra panels outside of the ones that we were running, as well as emceeing the concert on both nights. And uh, yeah, it was just it was it was great to be part of. It's always an honor to be able to to come out to BronyCon and put on a show. Once again, we managed to have Who's Line completely fill up main hall. Uh, saw it look like standing room only for that panel. So big thank you to everyone that came out. Big thank you to you guys who watched these vlogs. Gotta say a super big thank you to, uh, got some, some cool gifts this weekend as well as uh, fan art. Um, a real nice uh, Judy Hopps plush that I had never seen before. I didn't know that they existed and now I own one and I, uh, a super big thanks. In fact, the person who gave me that was right at the end of the Burning Track panel. And I don't feel like I properly got to say thank you. Um, so I don't know if they're, if you're watching and you're on YouTube, go ahead and comment, let me know, just so I can thank you again. Um, but yeah, this, uh, this weekend took a lot out of me. It usually does. We come here knowing that, you know, we're, we come here to work, and, uh, man, uh, every ounce of energy has been spent. So, this, uh, this isn't the last convention of the year. In fact, it's, it's looking like we might have two more on our slate here moving forward and cannot wait to uh, do some more, you know? So, 
Uh, again, a big thanks to everybody who came up for an autograph or a picture, or just a compliment saying that they enjoy watching, or had a number of people say that they came out to BronyCon to see me. And that's so humbling. It's so cool. So, so thank you to all of you, to uh, everyone I was able to interact with this weekend, except the person who got me sick. I'm a little bit disappointed in you. But other than that, I am also very forgiving. So, I, again, I cannot thank my friends enough. Um, it's always cool at BronyCon to be able to see everybody. There's so many people that come out to this. And uh, it's just a damn good time. I know they... I saw the number for attendance this year. I think it was about 6,600. So a little bit down from last year. But uh, could be a little bit circumstantial. So still very much looking forward to next year. But again, my friends, just uh, uh, all the, the different groups that we were hanging out with this weekend. It's just so much fun. And I, uh, I you know, I'm, a, I'm, I'm very lucky. I'm, I'm very lucky to have the friends that I have and be able to do the stuff that I do. And uh, yeah, so thank you to all, all of my my dear friends uh, and as well as all, all my audience, all my viewers. You guys rock. You rock. Yeah, so that's a wrap here on this BronyCon 2017 adventure. I'd be a little bit more woo, but there's not, there's nothing left. Nothing left. Quick, cue up the music, because this is the end of the 2017 Brony Gun Adventure. Woo! <laughs> HD Razor is signing off. Oh.